Right, well, this is what I have to do yet. A lot of this is garbage. I have to sort out what's on the table. Everything over here is organized the way I want it for now. And, and this still needs to be done as well. So, I was hoping to be done by today, but no. And it's 5 o'clock and I'm beat. I'm going to go have something to eat and call it a day. Here's tonight's dinner. Potatoes that I cooked a few days ago when I cooked the, uh, the beans. Then I had a little tiny bit of beans and rice mixed together left over so I put that in my little tiny burrito there and then salad, homegrown tomato, homegrown cucumber, cheese, and ranch dressing. And yes, this is vegetarian, not vegan. thing that I want to make and finish up, I have all this broth. This is the uh, beans with broth that I need to use up. I'm going to make that into a bean soup. These are the mushrooms and the mushroom broth. And this is the cauliflower and mushroom broth, because that was way too much broth. So I'm going to make a pot of soup, and I'm going to freeze some of it, because I have a lot of projects that I want to do in the house once the weather gets cold. Garden's winding down. I have to get that ready for winter and put it to bed. But there'll be nothing like a nice, beautiful, hot bowl of soup when I'm done with all my projects and I won't have to cook it. Here's another meal I'm making. The, this is a cut up eggplant and I brushed it with garlic oil and put some Italian seasoning on it. And this one over here I already baked. I had a couple of eggplants and I didn't want them to go bad because they were from my garden. So I'm just cooking these ahead and I'll see what kind of a recipe I can make. I baked them for 25 minutes in a 375 oven, turned them around, put more olive oil and um, Italian seasoning on it and, and baked it for another 10 minutes and uh, now I'm going to just keep them in the fridge and make a dish out of them. Something Italian, I'm thinking. Hello. All right, I'm getting ready to go out back into the garage, but I made my dinner first. I had some beets that needed to be used up or they would have gone bad. So I roasted these beets with a white potato that I need to use up as well. And I only seasoned it with some tahini and it's very tasty and that's enough for about three meals for me so I might even freeze some of it I'm not sure so um, then I have one potato left I cooked four and this is the last one left so I may fry that up I'm not sure and then this is the cauliflower <laughs> that I know it looks kind of green but it's not <clears throat> that I cooked up the cauliflower soup and it's very thick and I ended up adding a little bit more uh, Laurie's seasoned salt some a little nutmeg garlic uh, powder and onion powder and I blitzed that all up and some of this half of it I'm going to use as a soup and the other half I'm going to use as a gravy so because it has a real nice gravy consistency so that'll be enough for two meals and then I had the one potato yet that I cut up and that I'm going to put half my soup with so this will be my dinner tonight and it'll be a potato cauliflower soup but use up what you have and then get creative with it. I mean this is uh, very tasty even though it doesn't look that great 
and it does not look like cauliflower soup because of all the colors I had in the cauliflower and also because I added the mushrooms. So, but that's okay. I mean, it makes a great gravy. Very tasty. And I may eat that with my last potato. All right, so I'm going to go back out into the garage day four. Oh, I'm almost done. I'll be very happy when I am done. Then it's on to the next project. Here's my cauliflower soup. That doesn't look like cauliflower soup. It looks more like cream of mushroom, but it's very tasty. And I put some potatoes in there. So I'm going to enjoy my dinner. And then we'll see what we're going to do tomorrow with the garage. Okay, friends, here is my last dinner from the uh, cauliflower mushroom soup gravy, whatever. Um, I made some instant Idaho and mashed potatoes, and that is some homemade vegan ham that I made and had frozen a while back. And I put gravy on that, and it really was delicious. And then just for my veggies, I had some uh, of the beets I cooked up the other day with the tahini and um, just a store-bought cucumber. No more fresh from the garden. Those are done. So another quick and easy dinner after my garage cleaning and took no time to put together. Okay, so I got all this organized, all done, and all this is organized. I know it's not pretty, but it is organized. And this is all done. Starting to bring in my bulbs. And tomorrow is garbage day, so all the garbage goes out, yay. Now on to my next project, the attic. And it's not terrible, but it has a lot of things up there that I don't use anymore. So it took me two days longer than I figured it would, but that's okay. So I have lots of room for my car now. So that's my main goal. Lots of room in the middle. So thanks for hanging out with me while I cleaned my garage. The project that I need to do is get up in my attic and I have tons of Christmas stuff up there that I need to get rid of because I'm not going to use it anymore. But I had to organize my garage first so when that happens, this will be all full of Christmas things and I will call the uh, donation people to come and pick it up. So time to put the car in the garage. There's plenty of room. So it was a good day. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, comment, and like. Thanks for watching.